Hello! In this video, I'm going to be sewing Simplicity 9877, a summer nightgown. Because, hey, we got to be working a season ahead in sewing, right? <laughs> I'm sewing summer things. And it just so happens that this blouse that you see I'm wearing now, I had leftover material. So I decided with that leftover material, I am going to sew something I can wear for summer as a PJ because I happen to not have very many nightgowns at the moment. So I'm going to be making View 3. And this uh, pattern was printed in 1980. Yay! And even though this one technically isn't my size, I'm not going to have to size it up, which is really great because, as you can see on, in the picture, it's very um, non-fitted, right? It's a nightgown. You should be very comfortable in it. So let's get into that video and I hope you really enjoy it and like and subscribe and please put in the comments uh, if you have ever sewn any nightgowns and how that went for you and what do you think about nightgowns that you've made compared to maybe nightgowns that you've purchased. Um, I would love to yeah, know what you're working on. <laughs> All right, let's get started. So looking at view three which is the one I'm going to be making. I have cut out the pattern and I decided to go a bit shorter. So instead of uh, to down to the knee, I'm gonna do about mid thigh because I should have enough fabric for that. And I don't really want to wear very long nightgowns to sleep in. So I found the pattern pieces and was able to lay those out, cut it out and start with the step one. So V3 is view three nightgown. And it says prepare front same as view one and two. Okay, so front view one and two. Gather upper edge of front between outer notches to finish armholes machine stitch along seam line. Turn armhole edge to inside so it just meets stitching as shown. Press, turn press edge, pressed edge to inside again along stitching. Press. On outside top stitch a fourth an inch down from finished edge. Catching in hem, prepare your back seam as you did your front. Here is the front panel that I have cut out. And as you can see, I didn't want to do the full length, but I also didn't want to cut it because, well, who knows? <laughs> Maybe I'll make it for someone else and they'll want the full length or I could change my mind in the future, right? So all I did was I found the length that I wanted within the pattern already. So instead, I cut it this length here so it'll be a probably a bit about mid thigh or so okay so now I'm gonna jump in and do the stitching at the top and I'll show you all of that okay so this is the front here's the top part gathered and the sleeve part with a rolled hem very easy to do and then I said just repeat that for the back part so that's what I did I have the front and I have the back over here all right now it's time to move on to the front band and tie okay so that's the next part I will do that and okay and then go from so there. What I decided to do was make like a waistband instead of following their instructions exactly. And I'm going to add some lace in there. So I'm just going to pin this to the front and then insert the lace on top, stitch it in place and do the same thing on the back part. Now that I've stitched the first part of the waistband, I'm going to insert the lace and then put the top over like this and stitch that all the way this down. This is what the front looks like. 
So now I'm just going to do the back part and then stitch up the sides and hem it and it's finished. That easy. It's almost like somebody took two half size aprons and <laughs> tied them together. But the added armholes make a difference. So yeah, I think it's going to be really comfortable and good to wear in the summer as pajamas. The last part of this pajama or nightgown is just to go ahead and stitch the sides together and I'm gonna do a French seam on both of those and then hem the bottom and it's gonna be finished and I'll just do like a basic rolled hem. As you can see the front has this cute little lace and the back is just simple and plain. Okay, almost finished. And here is the finished product. <laughs> the armhole and that wonderful French seam, which is so comfortable to wear. I think I'm gonna love wearing this when it's really hot this summer. And this is the full view, how it ties at the top. Almost like two <laughs> half aprons put together. And it's so, it's gonna be really wonderful, I think, to wear this summer. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. See you next time.